Hey guys, what's up? Um, this is Josh. Just checking in. Wanting to say hello. Kind of give a little bit of an update, I guess. And So this is now day three with with the light phone, right? And so day three with the light phone. Um, I will say this. At first, like I've I've had a couple little hiccups here and there, okay, that I've noticed, and I guess the biggest hiccup or whatever, if you will, is I didn't realize I got so many calls, so many texts, and um, where I work, it's kind of crappy signal anyway, and so with that, um, I guess the signal was kind of going in and out, and when it comes in, it's like all these notifications just pile on top of one another, just boom, 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 and it was really kind of a mess, so the phone was almost getting bogged down is what it seemed like it was very strange um but anyway i will say you know doing the 90 minutes a day like i'm still sticking to it i'm still doing pretty good with it honestly um i'm not really missing it <laughs> i'm not really missing social media it's been interesting um, because that's what we do when we're bored, right? We just reach for our phone, and here we are, like, in the time of, like, quarantine and all this crap, and it's difficult, right? Because we get bored. Um, so, it's it's been weird, but one thing that I have done is I have started to pick up more uh, books, newspapers, like physical newspapers, physical books, um, things like that. I've also, I've been hitting the exercise bike, right? So I've been hitting the bike a little bit more, um, and trying to stay healthy and not get the quarantine 15, right? Um, but I'm trying to stay active in that way. I don't know what it is about this quarantine or whatever, but I've never been busier in my entire life, which is kind of hilarious, honestly. So, anyway, just kind of a quick little update, I guess. Like I said, this is day three. Um, not really missing social media yet. It, it's interesting because I do find myself with some form of some level of anxiety which is kind of weird kind of new to me anyway um, I'm not really much of an anxious person I guess but definitely like almost like a feeling like you're missing something right um, something on social media um, I, I don't know it's really really strange so I I'm missing that aspect of it, like, but I don't, that's just it, you don't even know what you're missing, right, it's just a, a weird anxious feeling of like, oh, I should check Facebook, oh, I should check Twitter, oh, I should get lost in the continuous scroll of TikTok or some stupid thing like that, right, and that's, that's usually when I think to myself, okay, what are you really missing out on? Like let's just take let's just take Facebook for a general example because Facebook is a monster, right? And everybody has it. So what am I really missing on Facebook? Generally, I'm missing a lot of arguments, especially lately, a lot of political horse crap. Um I'm looking at a lot of banter back and forth. And it's meaningless. It's meaningless. And so I think to myself, okay, that's what you're actually missing. You're missing high blood pressure, <laughs> right? You're missing arguments. You're, that's it. 
and then I feel better. It's almost like a wave of calm kind of comes over me. And then it's like, there's something so amazing and simplistic about this device. And it is something that I have missed. Um, just social interaction with people. Um, I, I guess I have a quick little story, right? So, like I said before, I was on my phone constantly, all the time. And now, uh, I had a conversation with my brother today. Uh, he stopped by and we were chatting. And he commented on the fact, he's like, you haven't pulled your phone out once. I'm like, no, I haven't. He's like, usually you're on that thing all the time. He didn't realize that I had switched over to this, to the to the light phone, right? Uh, so it was pretty cool, though. Um, it, it wasn't really like he was taking a jab. It was more just of like a, a general... I don't know, a, a general observation on his part where he was basically like saying like, oh, I would take out my phone and it almost seemed like I was ignoring him, right? Um, which is something that we do. This is something that people do now. We are at the dinner table and we take out our phones. We're out with friends and we're sitting around the dinner table out to dinner or whatever with friends and we take out our phones instead of having a general conversation and just acknowledging acknowledging the fact that your friends are there and present and you're both in the same room at the same time or whatever it's like that's the crap that we take advantage of I think so I, I'm so far I'm enjoying it again it's not without its struggles because then you start to understand you feel that pull like you want to pick up the phone and you want to check social media and do all this stuff and you feel that that pull and I can't I don't know again like you just cannot allow yourself to do it because it's, it's ridiculous I mean, social media has become a cesspool of crap. And I'm, I'm just, I'm done with it. <laughs> and so thank God, thank God that there is something like this out there right now that we're able to take advantage of and use and benefit from and just unfrickin' plug. For, even just for a moment, right? Unplug. Um, a very, very cool device. now. The next video I want to get into some more like the specs and I'm going to get into really kind of a deep dive of this and how it's behaving as a daily driver for me. So I hope everybody's doing great and we'll talk to you soon. Peace.